Hey guys, this is Crystal Reviewers with another Power Miners review. Um, the Lego Power Miners ages 18 through 14, product number 8190. It's the claw catcher this time. Instead of just the claw with um, the magma mech, that's what it's called. Claw catcher. Um, yeah, it comes with one lava monster, one crystal, and it comes with brains as the driver. Um, on the side here, number 15, Lava Series, and Adventures of Clutch Power, the first Lego movie. What? Oh. <laughs> okay, there you go. Okay, so on to the back. Um, so, the accessories is sausage, frying pan, axe, um, dynamite, shovel, the binoculars, and the crystal. Um, you really don't need a fire for this because you're down by the lava, so you just put the sausage on the frying pan, stick it over some lava, and you have some homemade sausage. Um, the main feature, you, the claw grabs out, and does the monster into the back, and it actually does work. Like some Lego sets, it doesn't work as well, but this one, it works perfectly. You just need it open, so you can actually put it in there. Um, yeah, and then you can open the cockpit, which are these two green pieces which are on some of the Lego Mars Mission alien ships. Um, I think that's all on the box. Oh, yes. Here we have this. <laughs> we got the sausage. We got brains with dynamite. And Feranox with the crystal. And this is actual size. It's about, about half my size of my thumb. Okay, so let's check the real thing out. So here we've got the Paranox with the crystal, and here comes the claw catcher. The claw does work if you just can grab him right. He's in here. It's cool, isn't it? Very. Yeah. And you can close it and bring it to Fort Lava Trash, which I don't have at this moment. Um, and you can grab the crystal, you have to, you can't pick it up with the claw, but you can put it back here on this spot. And here we have the which is opening and closing visor. Um, then we got the cockpit open thingy, which you can open and close separately. Mm -hmm. Then we've got these two huge, like, furnace things and things. Exhaust. We've got some more engine exhaust here, here, and here, and some more engine exhaust here. You think you get hot enough with the engine exhaust, let alone the lava? But luckily, he has this lava-proof um, suit, chromo suit, with this. Um, let me decapitate him for a moment. With this built-in cooling system, which is really cool. Um, let me put Brain's head back on, and his helmet, put him back to me. Yeah. Uh-huh, and then we got some lights here, number 15, windshield, and you don't think there are any bugs to worry about down here, because they'll all be skewered and fried by now. And then... The accessories on the side, you've got the pickaxe, the frying pan, and my favorite, if I can get it out, the sausage! Ah, sausage, anyone? Uh -huh. And it's on that side, and then the accessories on this side. Ooh. You got the shovel, the dynamite and the monoculus. So let's put them back where they 
Uh huh. So I just got this Lego set this morning, like around 1:30. I got home from a baseball game that took forever because of the rain. Um, cameraman and I um, videotaped them rolling up the tarp, and everyone was cheering. <laughs> they were cheering for the tarp rollers and not the actual players. <laughs> Which I kind of find kind of funny. And uh, and um, beware, this thingy comes off easily. Mm -hmm. and, and I find this funny. This sticker, if you can zoom in far enough, it says "Danger, flying monsters." The monster is flying because. Uh -oh. Because when you um, fling it, the claw stops here, so the monster flies the rest of the way. So, caution, flying monsters. Stick that on. Yeah, so, um, you can hold a max of like. Three lava monsters in here. I only have two here, though. Um, see? It can fit three. Might even be able to fit four. But, I don't know. Yeah. Oh, also these wheels are huge. And on the box, it looks big. In reality, it looks big. It's just big. And it's the highest number besides four lava trans, which is number 16. This is number 15. Um, yeah. And this is cool. You just pull this, and then when you want it to go back, you just push it. It's pretty neat. Um, this gizmo here, you pull this, which is attached by these rods on the walls. You pull it, it lifts. Uh oh, I dumped all the salt. Oh well. It lifts the claw, and then since it's heavy on the sides, it falls down. So then you just push it forward to put it back in the this position, and then you can do it over and over and over and over. You get the point. So put the accessories back. Sausage bag. I like the sausage. Um. Uh -huh. So. Yeah. So. Oh, also, I just noticed this. It has lights. So. Beep. 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 <laughs> I think this is like a bit bigger than a monster truck because. One of the minifigure guys is about six feet tall, I figure. So this would, this would be in reality about fifteen feet tall. This is a huge Power Rangers vehicle. Yep. So that's that with Crystal Reviewers signing off.